Hello YouTubers, this is Dandy97, aka Orion, and this is my 12th comics commentary. Today's episode is Thomas Goes Fishing, based on the story of the same name uh, by the Reverend Wilbert Audrey, and that story was featured in Tank Engine Thomas Again. The story is one of my favorite in the Railway series, and um, Tank Engine Thomas Again is one of my favorite books. And subsequently, this is one of my favorite episodes in all the series, but especially uh, Series 1, which Series 1 is not one of my favorite seasons. I mean, compared to some of the later seasons, like you know, Series 8 and onwards, I mean, obviously it's much better. But compared to uh, even Series 4, it, I just don't think it, it matches. But uh, that's for another time. Ever since I was a kid, I, I really liked this episode. It just has a very interesting and kind of humorous uh, premise. There's a very nice musical cue here with him lifting up the bucket. Even if it does have some quite uh, cheap production values. But hey, it's the first series. What you gonna do? This is the second um, in a series of four Thomas-based episodes, uh, and those would be uh, Thomas and the Conductor, uh, this one, Thomas Goes Fishing, Terrence the Tractor, and Thomas and Birdie's Great Race. And I like this uh, kind of tense, almost melancholy version of the Thomas theme by Michael Donnell and Junior Campbell. And in the U.S., uh, this video or this episode was first featured on the video "Jane Learns a Lesson" and other stories. Now, normally, all we see is the station part of Farquhar, but this is the first time that we really actually see, uh, you know, what's what's beyond that. And I believe it's the only time that we ever get to see it throughout the entire series. Sir Topham Hat actually appears a lot um, in this early first batch of episodes. Whereas uh, later he doesn't appear as much. Riddler Star, uh, his narration in this episode is actually quite uh, good. It's it's a little more exciting. Uh, you can really tell that he that he's interested in the story and that he puts emotion behind uh, Thomas's uh, feelings about the fish and the boiler and everything. Um, whereas in some other series one episodes, um, he's actually quite boring. But in this one, he's actually very charismatic. And of course, this episode served as kind of an inspiration to the Series 4 song, Gone Fishing. Alright, I hope you enjoyed my commentary. Thanks. Bye.